What's going on guys, it's Awana Turtle. Today we are doing another Pokemon opening. We're getting into more of this Detective Pikachu boxes. Today we're going with the big one, the Charizard GX one. Uh, very excited about this. Uh, this is one does have a more compared to the Mewtwo GX. Uh, the only one that's on par would be that Greninja one, which we'll probably get into next video. Uh, quick reminder that tomorrow we are announcing the winner of our latest giveaway. We're giving away a Reshi Ram Charizard uh, from Double Blaze. So it is the um, Reshi Ram Charizard card that's going to be featured in Unbroken Bonds due out next month. Uh, so do check out my video from Friday if you have already not entered. Uh, there's a couple things you have to do and just follow the instructions and uh, we'll announce the winner sometime on Monday. So, all right, let's get into this Charizard box. Okay, let's get into this box. So let's take a quick look at what's inside. So we do get a promo card featuring Charizard GX, the full, the jumbo size of that, a metal coin, five uh, Detective Pikachu packs, and then two additional packs, and then a code card. So um, definitely a little has a little bit more compared to the Mewtwo. And I do want to point out that this is an actual metal coin. Uh, so I really appreciate it. And this is pretty cool, uh, the little uh, emblem too for the movie. And compared to the one we got in yesterday's video where this is the typical plastic thing, this one's actually a metal coin, so I really like that. Uh, here's one of the, the code card that came with the box. We have our Charizard GX. The downside is, or another, the last upside is that it comes with five Detective Pikachu packs. Uh, however, the two additional booster packs are Crimson Invasion Guardians Rising uh, compared to Burning Shadows. Again, Sun and Moon, nice, no XY. Uh, however, I'm not crazy about either of those two sets. Uh, we are going to open a Burning Shadows though as we are doing another Pokemon video. And uh, yeah, just again, quick reminder to go check out the video from Friday um, to make sure you enter this giveaway. And uh, actually, we'll save this one for last. So let's go through Guardians Rising and then uh, Crimson Invasion first coin is nice though so after I had some more time to think about these detective Pikachu collection boxes um I think they're actually like a home run I feel like there's a lot right with it where it's not just the um, the stuff for the movie uh, and it does come with some of the Sun and Moon stuff as well so it's kind of like oh well I'm I still I'm still going for some of the Sun and Moon cards um, however I do want to also get some of the promos so uh, I just feel like they did a really good job uh, as far as distributing I want I would have preferred some of the GX's to be in the actual packs and to basically have some chase cards within the uh, promo set itself all right so for our <laughs> What is this, Crimson Invasion? Uh, we have a Cell of Cell Gore. And then we have, ooh, Alolan Golem Full Art. Very nice. When it comes to Alolan's uh, Golem, he's one of the cooler ones. Just the fact that he's electric, a electric rock. It's very cool. Uh, then his thing, is whatever this is, it almost reminds me of like a railgun kind of thing, especially if you're electric type. So very nice start to the box. And so far, these Detective Pikachu boxes have been pretty good as far as pulls go. Um, as far as the Detective Pikachu packs, the we did get a Pikachu. However, we didn't get, uh, I think it's the um, the Charizard regular, the non-GX Charizard still. So hopefully we do get one of those. All right, we have a Grass Energy, Lampin, a Fable. This looks very cartoonish. Uh, Marini, Tailo, Phantom. Uh, Castform, Nosepass, Deli Bird, Chillin', uh, Slowpoke, and then a Gothitelle. Alright, let's get into these Detective Pikachu packs. You guys just have to get used to there being only so many cards. Um, I'm curious to see kind of like which of these ends up being the chase. I feel like the obvious answer is, oh, I'm just here, uh, would be the Pikachu and the Charizard. And so we got a Morlo, and then a Machamp. This one's actually pretty interesting. Uh, the first move is pretty bad, but I do think Cross Chop is pretty good. Uh, flip a coin, you do if you get heads, you do 140 versus 80. For only two energy, that's in my opinion, that's uh, strong enough. So put this guy in a sleeve. All right, but yeah, I think um, I don't know if there was. Especially since the cards come with like sun and all the boxes come with sun and moon packs. 
uh, like if they kind of followed that paradigm where there's like I don't know, full art or hyper rare or something and even actually I think it would almost be better if it's very difficult to pull uh, so we have a we had a look at tongue which is creepy <laughs> snubble which actually snubble is pretty cool Jigglypuff is creepy and then a ditto so we pulled this one last time as well and I wasn't crazy about it just because of his attack uh, where you need the correct energies versus just having the right amount of energy This Charizard I feel like they did a really good job with him um, It's almost like too realistic But uh, he really does feel like a kind of like a dragon kind of thing or a reptile lizard. Ooh, Greninja um, I think I'm Typically not a huge fan of Greninja. However, the from the trailer, I think the Greninjas look super cool. They're kind of just like flipping around, throwing their Shrikens, and uh, yeah, they just feel very dangerous. They actually feel like ninjas. All right, so we are down to two packs left. But we still have our Burning Shadows pack as well, and. Uh, yeah, so what is your guys' favorite box so far? Um, I think I do, yeah, again, like, as far as this, all the different boxes, like, the one with the, the folio, which I actually have right here, um, it's not, it's it's a much better than the other portfolios, those little ones. Uh, this is by no means, like, super high quality, but for something that just comes with the, the box, I'm very happy with it. Um, and maybe I'll just use that just to put, like, the full um, movie set. So for our second to last pack, we got Charmander, Lickitung, Psyduck, and then another Greninja. Nice. There's a code card. Let's put these two over here. And the fact that they're all promo is really it's a good addition as well. So let's go into this Lax pack. We're still looking for our first Charizard. I can't remember if there's a Mewtwo. I think there is. For some reason I'm kind of blanking on that. But I would say Charizard is probably the one we want the most. And uh, obviously, a, a Detective Pikachu is always nice. Charmander, I do like the Bulbasaur art. Lickitung, and then another Machamp. Wow, wow, we're getting a lot of duplicates in this opening. So, last thing we have to do today for this video is this Burning Shadows uh, pack. So, if you guys are enjoying this Detective Pikachu content, please hit that like button. Uh, we're going to be doing it for a while. Um, do have a bunch of the stuff coming in and ooh, this card's damaged a little bit but at least it's not the rare and uh, maybe next time we'll do the uh, Greninja one and we'll see if we can sneak in one of those uh, lunchbox kind of things those ones are always kind of weird they come with like a lot of random amount of stuff all right so we have for our last pack of the opening we have Sock, Noibat, Stuffle, another Sock for the reverse and then a Heracross regular rare I feel like we pulled a number of him so to wrap up, I would say this was a pretty solid box, not the best. Uh, so from some cool um, duplicates we got would be that Greninja and then Machamp. We did pull a full art from the Crimson Invasion pack, which I'm really happy with in the Alolan Golem. I feel like this is one of the ones where, to be honest, compared to the Hyper Rare, I do like the coloring here. It kind of makes everything pop. Uh, so the full art's really nice. And then we did, of course, get that Charizard GX um, from the movie. Really happy with that. So, um, thanks for watching guys, uh, as always, uh, if you want to support the channel, hit that like button down below. If you're new to the channel, definitely hit that subscribe button and bell for notifications. I'm Awana Turtle, and I'll catch you guys next time. Peace.